what is going on guys and welcome back to the final video of 2020 so i started this channel back up on may 24th uh 2020 um and uh yeah it's just been uh really really fun since then making videos for you guys um so yeah it's gonna be the final video of 2020 like i said um so hope you guys have enjoyed my channel in this pretty much half a year that i've been on youtube so um yeah just thank you to everybody and that is subscribe who has checked out my videos like all my videos um thank you and this it's been really fun in 2020 even though it's been really really rough um uh, like i said i started this channel in may which was pretty much in the prime of quarantine um and i really had not much to do so i figured what the heck um i'll give it a whirl and um you guys have treated me really really good um you know it's just been really fun and yeah so this is gonna be my final video of 2020 and it's gonna be a special one so i'll be showing off my top 30 um or not not top 30 top 25 cards in my collection um so yeah we're just gonna get right into it and uh yeah so um first card up is a 1973 tops uh Rookie third baseman, um, Terry Hughes, Bill McNulty, and Ken Wright, um, in a near mint, uh, s near mint seven, um, PSA seven, right there, uh, beautiful card, and, um, yeah, so, 1973 rookie third baseman, awesome card with a cub on there, so, really like that card. That's going to be number 30, or why do I keep saying 30? Number 25 on this list. Um, whoops. So, number 29 uh, is going to be a 1981 Tops uh, Keith Hernandez Near Mint to Mint 8. Um, beautiful looking card, uh, even though he is on the Cardinals in this card. So, uh, picked this up. Uh, two days ago, posted it today, so, yeah, that's an awesome card right there, okay, um, that is number 24, number 23 on my list, we have a Greg Maddox, um, this is, actually, you know what, I'm gonna do a quick video in video swap um this is going to be my non my first non graded card in this video and it's going to be a mario lemieux uh 1990 tops um mario lemieux uh one of the great one of the greats um in hockey all time uh for the penguins obviously wearing the backwards or the upside down number of Wayne Gretzky, so he was uh, a great player, probably second best player of all time, um, so behind Wayne Gretzky, so yeah, that is number 23, uh, number 20, hold on, number 22 is going to be a 1988 uh, Fleer, Greg Maddox, in a mint nine. This is a second year card, as you can see. So, pretty cool card right there. And, uh, yeah, like I said, graded a mint nine. Um, number, what, one, two, three... Number 21, wait, 25, 24, 23, 22. Yeah, uh, number 21 is a Frank Thomas 
rookie from 1990 uh, tops. Um, as you can see, number one draft pick. Uh, he was in his Auburn uniform there, but um, obviously he is on the White Sox. So pretty good looking card overall. So I might send that to PSA. Um, going on to number twenty, it is a, it is a, yeah, it's the first modern card of uh, this video, and it's a Bo Bichette um, rookie card from twenty twenty tops series one. Um, great looking card, love Bo Bichette, and uh, hopefully he turns out to be uh, to be um, uh, like. Just as good, if not better, than his father was, Dante Bichette. So, hopefully he turns out to be great. Yeah. Um, number 19. Right, yeah. Uh, is a Pete Alonzo rookie card from 2019 Top Series 2. Uh, one of the most coveted sets, um, in the past three years or so, so... Um, yeah, I pulled this out of a 2019 Series 2 Fat Pack. So, that is a really cool card. Yeah. Uh, next up, number, what, 20... Um, hmm, number, I don't know, I'll, um, I think this is, um, this one, okay, I don't know, I'll just, I'll just, um, put all the, uh, 25 cards down in the description, um, because I have lost count, um, already, but, uh, yeah, that's my bad, and, uh, yeah, so this is 21, 20, 19, I think this is gonna be 18, yeah, uh, so my bad there, um, but yeah, this card is a 2019, 2018, uh, Tops Update, Glaber Torres, another one of those coveted sets that I was talking about, Glaber Torres, um, haven't had, I mean, he's a young stud, he's had... A pretty good career. I mean, some some people still believe in him, and I am one of those people. So hopefully he turns out to be really good. Yeah. Uh, this is number 17. Um, yeah, number... Mm -hmm. Number 17 on the list. Fernando Tatis Jr., Tops Gallery, um, yeah, I mean, not really much I can say about this guy, um, he's young, he's, he's fast, he's a good hitter, he hits bombs, so, I mean, he's, he's just really good. Uh, number 16 is, um, if you haven't seen this video, go check it out, Bo Bichette, um, not gonna spoil anything but just go through my videos and you'll probably find uh in the title so um yeah Bo Bichette rookie variation I mean this is just a beautiful card and by the way sorry for the scratches on the top loader but yeah that's an awesome card from 2020 tops update uh next up is a 2020 Panini Prism Joe Burrow rookie card. Just a sick card. Um, hopefully he comes back next year in 2021. Um, uh, strong and better than ever. So Joe Burrow, I like him. He's cool. So that was... Yes, yeah, 17, 16, 15. Uh, number 14. We're halfway through. Number 14 is 
a 2019 Tops Stadium Club of Vladimir Guerrero Jr. in a Mint 9. Just really love the picture on this card. And I it was at a really good price, so I got it for my birthday this year. Um, so, yeah, that's a awesome card. Uh, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13 is a, um, 2019 Tops Update, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Um, this is his base. Really love this guy. Uh, I think he's going to turn out to be really good. So, yeah, love that card. Uh, number 12 on the list is going to be a 2019 Tops Living of Vladimir Guerrero Jr. in a Gem Mint 10. Beautiful, beautiful card. I mean, just an awesome card in general. So, yeah. 11 is going to be... A 2019 Tops Update, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., 1984 Tops Baseball, Gem Mint 10. Um, just an awesome, awesome card to have in the collection, especially if you're a Vladdy um, super collector like me. Um, he's one along with Javier Baez, which you'll see later in my Top 25. So... Num um get going into the top ten um with a banger. It is a Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Um been been on a Vladdy like streak here. But uh yeah, it is a Vladdy um uh twenty nineteen Tops Gallery Blue Auto numbered out of fifty. So that is a really, really cool card. Super. Uh, definitely my best Vladdy card. Uh, number nine is going to be a 2015 Tops Update. Chris Bryant. Um, rookie debut card. Just a really cool picture. And Chris Bryant, um, I mean, he's one of the Cubs' all-time greats. Um, whether you like them or not, in my opinion. Um, but, yeah, that's an awesome card. Uh, number eight is going to be a uh, 2011 uh, Bowman Chrome of um, Javier Baez. First Bowman Chrome. There we go. Um, awesome card. If I send it in a PSA right now, I think I'd get a 9. Because the back is off-centered and the front is a little bit. So, yeah. Uh, number 7 on this list is going to be a 2015 Topps uh, Javier, T Top Series 1 Javi Baez Base Rookie. Pretty cool card. Um, if you're a Cubs fan, it's pretty iconic. So, uh, yeah the back yeah number six is a 1990 second year leaf of ken griffey jr um yeah i mean that that's just a really nice card there's the back ken griffey jr one of the all-time greats so uh yeah that's an awesome card Moving into the top five, um, and it's a pretty cool one in a Bo Jackson uh, Future Stars card from 1987 Tops. Um, just awesome, awesome card with the wood border. And um, it's becoming a pretty iconic card, and it already has been for a long time. So, yeah. Number four on my list 
is going to be a Shaquille O'Neal from 1992-1993 Fleer. This is a Shaq rookie. Um, once again, awesome card to have in the collection. So, going into the top three with um, probably a lot of people's favorite football player right now, and that is Patrick Mahomes, the second rookie card from 28, 2017, uh, Donruss. Um, just a pretty cool card, and it's pretty valuable, so pretty cool to have that in the collection. So, yeah. Um, number two on my list is going to be this, uh, Stan Musial Auto from, uh, 2015, um, uh, what was it called? Where's the box at? Here it is. Uh, 2015 Leaf Heroes of Baseball. Um, yeah, it's just a really nice card. So, yeah, obviously, Stan Musial, one of the all-time greats, as I keep saying. But that's a good thing because that means I have all-time greats cards. Good cards. So, uh, yeah, um, Stan Musial Auto, really cool, even though he is a Cardinal. And um, the moment you've all been waiting for, number the number one card in my collection. You already know what it is. Kobe Bryant rookie card uh, from 19, uh, 1990, 1996, 1997, um, uh, Upper Deck SP, yeah, um, just an awesome card, sick pic picture, a uh, cool blue, um, like, border there on the left side. And overall, just a beautiful card of Kobe's. Rest in peace to Kobe. Um, just top 10 player of all time. I mean, not not really much I can say about him. Or he, it, all the stuff that's about him, it won't fit in this video. So, um, yeah, I mean, he is just, he'll forever be in our hearts. And we'll, we'll always remember him as uh one of the best basketball players to ever play the game so um yeah uh that is my top 25 sports cards in my collection um of 2020 so um yeah that's that's um uh hopefully i'll be looking back at this video and saying wow my collection has improved a lot in 2021 but for now, I'm really happy and grateful. So, uh, yeah, that's going to do it for the video. I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you in 2021.